a message from the Queen. In 1868, a group of friends began meeting and decided to form the Toronto Astronomical Club. The club persisted under various names, including the Astronomical and Physical Society of Toronto, and finally, the Toronto Astronomical Society, as the use of the word, physical, raised many Victorian eyebrows. By 1900, it was clear that limiting the society to Toronto, wasn't appropriate, as several other nearby communities had affiliated themselves with the group. In 1902, shortly after the first ever official tour of Canada by my great-grandfather, Edward Seven, Royal Fever, was at its height, and the society's councillors seized upon the idea of going royal. After some debate, it was also decided to seek the appellation of Canada instead of Toronto, or even of Ontario. It was a bold move to open up the society to the whole nation. In January 1903, a petition was drawn up and forwarded to King Edward VII to use the prefix royal in the name of the society. On 1903 March 3, the Royal Astronomical Society of Canada was officially incorporated. Thank you for your attention. Bye.